what's the best mindset training? I've certainly done a few. Uh, I would say pe people, and that, I will give you other resources, right? I'm not just gonna be like, oh, mine, of course. <laughs> right, uh, so a lot of, over the years, a lot of people have given us um, you know, feedback on our course called The Power Mind. So The Power Mind, there's a lot of people that have given us great uh, feedback on the course I did a few years ago called Power Mind. Um, so that's, that's certainly one option for you. Um, as far as mindset, let me think about you know things that made an impact on me. Um, so I'll, I'll list out some books. So here are some books that helped my mindset. Not necessarily in order, um, but um, you know one is Atlas Shrugged. Um, and the reason that was impactful to me is, I used to be that person that always looked for, um, you know, what, how do I, how do I, uh, you know, how to get something for free? You know, how do I, how do I get that pirated movie? How do I get that, you know, is there any way to get that course for free? Is there any way, like I, I used to um, be that type of person. I know people, a lot of people do that. This made me greatly better appreciate intellectual property and the energy of, of man and, and, and women that you know put their efforts into creating something and honoring of producers. And so after I read that book, I will not watch a pirated movie. I don't want a pirated course or anything like that. Um, and so I, it definitely raised my vibration of how I, how I thought. And so, so that, is, that was a good one for, you know, for me. Um, mindset wise, there's one, I don't like the title. I really don't feel like it does it justice. Um, but there's a little known book. This is not like a, a mega popular book, but it's actually called How to Get Rich by Felix Dennis. And Felix Dennis is the creator of Maxim Magazine. Um, he's like a magazine mogul. I don't know if he's still alive. I'm not, I'm not sure. Um, but his How to Get Rich book is, is really eye-opening and it's like it's really it's different and and so like in it he talks about um you know different levels of income and what they actually mean and you know so so his take and i'm not saying i agree with it but i i respect the um i respect that this is one person's perspective he's like uh less than two hundred fifty thousand a year poverty um <laughs> <laughs> and then he just kind of goes through, and uh, I think he's worth he, at least at one point he's worth like nine hundred million dollars, and uh, and so it, it's a really different, interesting book. Um, another one, uh, War of Art, not uh, Art of War. Now, Art of War, I'm not saying that's a bad book, but I'm just saying this is a different book by St Stephen Pressfield, and it's something that um, really will help anybody trying to accomplish something to show up more powerfully, to, um, to fight through the resistance and, and do the work. In fact, I think that might be his, he's got War of Art, Turning Pro, and I think he has a do the work. I actually got the chance to interview Steven and he's incredible. So that's a great book, um, but there, there's a few for you. Um, I'll tell you that you wanna be careful with um, focusing in on mindset training, and I know this sounds strange, you actually want to be careful with going to spending too much time on mindset training because you can only change yourself so much by study. And so it's much better for you to get in the streets, to get your jersey dirty, to go and do some stuff imperfectly than it is for you to just constantly study mindset training all, all the time. And so like get, get in the streets, right? Get busy, uh, go fall on your face, go look stupid, go do a video and you don't know what the hell you're saying, right? Go do that speech that you're terrified to do. And so you can only change yourself so much by study. You got to go do the stuff. Full, um, focusing in on mindset training, and I know this sounds strange. You actually want to be careful with 
going to spending 